Welcome to our new food technology unit on new food products. In this section we're going to have a look at reasons for developing new products and we're going to split it into two parts. So this short video is going to contain uh, the reasons including customer concerns such as health and environmental issues and we're also going to have a look at technological developments. You also have a mind map in style that you need to be filling out so I would suggest that you actually pause after each section um, and get your summary notes down. People love buying new products. We will look at two important reasons that consumers choose new foods. The first one is for their health concerns and the second one is concern about the environment and their effect. Consumers have more and more access to information. They can make decisions based on TV shows, the internet, social media, friends opinions, health food shops or any kind of advertisement. There are an increasing number of diet related disorders at the moment. Have a look at the list of the top diseases in Australia. With so much information around, people can easily shop to suit their health needs. Popular food choices at the moment include gluten-free options. So here we have the Sunrise and Fantastic Rice Crackers. Kellogg's have also gone gluten-free with their old favourite Special K and Corn Flakes. Another new trend to do with health is the use of various grains. So here we have Uncle Toby's oats with added rye, puffed millet and quinoa. Fantastic rice crackers have also started adding quinoa, buckwheat, millet and amaranth to their products. People are becoming increasingly concerned about the sugar in their diet. People who support Sarah Wilson and her I Quit Sugar phenomenon can now go and buy these pre-packaged muesli bar mix and gluten-free muffin mixes. Any milk imaginable is also available. Many of these products used to only be available in specialty health food stores. As more and more people become aware, big companies join in and get their slice of the consumer money. Another concern that consumers have is for the environment. Consumers want products that have a minimal impact on the land, water and air. They also want to know that the environment has been cared for. This can also lead customers to eating more vegetables and grains which use less resources. Some consumers actually want their products to be sustainable or free range. We see this with the uh, new varieties of fish that are out, free range pork, free range eggs. Food waste is also a main concern for customers. How can we reduce waste? This also gets consumers to have a look at how much packaging is on their products. You might have seen the new John West ads where they are advertising that their tuna is all certified by the MSC. This means that the tuna is sustainable and they are promoting that they are looking after the environment. Some consumers like to know that their product's been certified organic and that hasn't used pesticides in the production. Others are keen to know that the RSPCA endorses the treatment of the animals who've laid the eggs. Ultimately, satisfying the customer needs leads to more sales and then more company profits. 